Living next to railroad tracks may always cause a headache, but for some people in two North Little Rock neighborhoods, it's more than just background noise. Yeah, they say ditches belonging to the railroad are left to grow wild and are causing major issues for homeowners. Katrin Asaf is in Rixie now with one such area. Katrin, what are you seeing there? Well, Donna, Kevin, this is what's so concerning. This is a ditch right next to the tracks that's filled with water. You can see a paper plate right there, a number of tires in the background. Now, this is what have residents of Rixie and McCallum aren't so upset. They're saying that this isn't being taken care of. Now, this property technically is owned by Union Pacific Railroads right next to these tracks here. It stretches all the way throughout North Little Rock, but the residents here, after years, are tired of seeing this. They say something needs to be done. Having a railroad in your backyard is never peaceful. For these neighbors in North Little Rock, the noise isn't the issue. Really, we've just been robbed. Charles Sampson lives in Rixie. He says for years his home has been waterlogged due to poor drainage in backyard ditches, part of which is coming from the tracks. We're getting flooded from the railroad tracks on the back and from 161 on the front. He's seen home after home deteriorate from the sludge, his house included. This is the ceiling. Justice of the Peace Christina Gully says she can handle the roadway, but the railroad, it's another concern. But what I can see, it's been neglected for years. Down the road, Ulysses Robinson and McAlmont has seen this firsthand. Sometimes it'd be so many limbs that it touched the ground. Hundreds of branches hang over his property, brush that's on Union Pacific land. It's not our responsibility, it's the railroad. Gully has made it her mission to see her neighbors taken care of and claims these ditches aren't an issue in other parts of the city. When you go in other neighborhoods with train tracks, you don't see this type of neglect. But for those in these neighborhoods, they just want their voices to be heard over the roar of the train. But they want to be respected, that's all. of the roar of the train. You can hear it right next to me right now. Now, Union Pacific has released a statement saying, quote, Union Pacific values the communities through which we operate and works hard to be a good neighbor. We respond to and investigate concerns when we receive them. Any individual is encouraged to call 1-800-UPRRCOP to report incidents that involve the railroad, end quote. Now, they also tell me that they're going to be reaching out to neighborhood representatives to see if they can learn more about this issue and see what can be done. Reporting in Rixie, I'm Kate Renee. Back to you.